some of the women that come here has never been called beautiful before. So our main focus is to just build them up. Perfect. All right. I am Vanessa Howard, and I'm a professional hairstylist. I've been running Giving Hands Beauty Salon for three and a half years. I came up with the, the idea for doing the free sessions for the salon to start giving back once a month to homeless women who were broken as I was. I was homeless for almost two years and I had tried, tried to commit suicide on several occasions. I became homeless through um, uh, my children's father. I, I had to leave out that abusive relationship. And so I left him and that was the start of my, my homelessness. And I had actually three children during that time, during that process. And, and we lived from place to place and you know, from shelter to shelter and um, just, not having anywhere to go. We typically do five to seven women once a month for our, our um, give backs. We do a, a full catered lunch. He's in, he's 13, he's in meeting with my mom. No. He's having very mature for He is, he's actually the reason for At least they're real and you didn't think it was my great mind. You want to have them sitting down? No, yeah, this, this is perfect. We do start off with doing hair, and then we do facials, we do nails, we do uh, eyebrows and makeup. So the women, when they come in to our, they come in with walls up, they come in broken, they come in also not knowing what to expect. And so we greet them, first of all, with just warm arms and just welcoming them and making them feel loved. Big hugs and big smiles. That's part of the side. Okay. Yeah, like this area. When I was staying at the Salvation Army, it was for the homeless, and they had um, some people come to help the homeless, you know, give haircuts and stuff like that. And um, one of the people there had um, chopped all my hair off. I had really long, beautiful hair. And, I was pretty devastated because it's taken me my whole life to, to grow my hair. For me, you know, it's easy to love on these women because it's, it's, a, it's a place that I come from. What prompted me to be a part of Giving Hands Foundation and to help uh, these women uh, is from where we came from, being homeless before. I remember the most um, is how people made you feel, um, how they treated you like you were less than or and not equal to them. Well, I went through an actual panic attack when I sat down because I was reliving the nightmare of what I'd went through. And it took her to actually, with kindness and love, help me through that panic attack before I, I could actually let her touch me. And because she took the time to let me, you know, talk to her about what happened. I was able to let her cut my hair. So I just want to thank, say thank you very much for helping me, for helping me do that. It feels wonderful making other survival, survivors feel beautiful. I almost talked myself out of not coming. I'm glad you came. You really are, thank you so much. Never been to spa, never been to a beauty salon. It's very nice. <laughs> <laughs> it makes me feel younger. Just considering I've been 
feeling rather down. It, it gave me, um, put a little bit of faith and hope back in me. Um, I just get overjoyed to see when women gain their confidence, gain their self-esteem back and feel whole again. <laughs> oh, she got two ways. <laughs> um, I never heard of a, a salon helping people. In today's society, they would rather step over you than help you, help you up off the street. And that's the truth, you know. And that's what's so sad about it. Oh, yeah. I'm ready. Oh, are you ready? Yeah, I'm ready. <laughs> All right, she's ready for you. Oh, yeah, I'm ready. Oh, there you go. The community has acted extremely well through the sessions that we've given. 98% um, of the women have gotten jobs and homes through our, um, our give backs. So it's been very successful in the community. Just making a difference in that one person's life is, is more than enough for me. Love it. <laughs> Perfect. All right, done. My mom, she would always talk about one day giving back to women that went through similar situations and to see whatever their issues are, to see the actual salon and to see it in action is just, you know, it, it's life changing. Some of these women coming he here have dealt with domestic violence, have dealt with uh, homelessness. Some of these women even de dealing with suicide. And they begin to open up to us and um, allow us to just feel better about themselves. I feel blessed to be able to have that opportunity again. I love my new look. Just being able to um, serve them and, and love on them, um, it, it really, really helps us to stay humble and it helps us not to forget, you know, where we've come from. Everybody hug, give hugs, we're gonna take a picture. Oh, yeah. So, it's okay. It's okay. Hey.